A drive-by shooting in Inglewood left a young father dead. More than a year has gone by. The case still open. Elizabeth Espinosa has tonight's Crime Stoppers investigation you'll only see here on KTLA. Good evening, everyone. I'm Elizabeth Espinosa. In tonight's Crime Stoppers, Inglewood police say a 21-year-old man used to live here with his grandmother. He was on his way to work one morning until three suspects pulled up. Today it was my loved one. Tomorrow it could be somebody yours. Ruth says she had just left home, had just kissed her grandson, Ira Tyrone Kroger, goodbye, when she received that phone call. My other daughter was just screaming and saying that Tyrone had been shot. And Mr. Kroger was sitting in his vehicle, which was parked here. Inglewood Police Detective Waters says 21-year-old Tyrone was in his car about to leave for work. It was 10.30 a.m. Thursday, February 25th of last year, Outside 833 West Beach Avenue, there were three male Hispanic suspects. The uh, suspects pulled up on the driver's side of Mr. Koger's vehicle, uh, fired into uh, his vehicle. Did they say anything? Well, according to witnesses, they asked him where he was from, mm. which is typically, you know, what gang members will do to find out what, what uh, gang the other person's from. Oh, God. Tyrone's family says he was not in gangs. He had just turned 21 and was a cargo handler at LAX and a dedicated father to his eight-month-old daughter. It feels like, like a part of me was killed that day. It, uh, Tyrone was my only grandson. And uh, from the hospital to my house, I raised him. He still called me mom. Mrs. Allen says Tyrone always protected grandma and the rest of his family. Beside being my grandson, he was my best friend. We could talk, we could share things, he would tell me anything, we could tell each other anything, and um, he was just a good person. There is a $25,000 reward in this case. Please help catch Tyrone's killers. Leave your tip anonymously at 1-800-222-TIPS, T-I-P-S. You can also text Crime Stoppers or email them. In Inglewood, Elizabeth Espinosa, KTLA 5 News.